Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back. It's Travis here with JT Wealth. In today's video, we're going to be talking about two strong buy stocks that could be at an absolute discount compared to where they'll go in 2022. We're talking about between 50 and over 60% potential upside for these two stocks we're going to talk about today. So let's get into it. All right, thanks for coming back, checking out the channel, guys. Hopefully you find something of value in today's video. If you do, don't forget, take two seconds out of your day, smash that like button for me, consider subscribing to the channel, hit the notification bell, stay up to date with all of my recent videos, and when you do stuff like that, it just really helps out the channel, so we do appreciate it. And like I said in the intro, today's video is about two stocks that are a bargain right now with strong buy analyst ratings and between 50 and 60% potential upside for 2022. But before we get into the two stocks, I want to make kind of a personal comment to everybody who does take the time to comment on my videos, especially when we do crypto videos. A lot of scammers and spammers, they push out those mass comments pushing you towards a Telegram account or, you know, send somebody this number and they'll tell you how to make a million dollars in crypto overnight. Most of those are all spam and scam. So what I do is I isolate certain crypto words that they use frequently and put them into YouTube so that it automatically flags those comments for review. Now, I don't get to check every single comment that gets flagged for review. So if your comment doesn't show up immediately after you post it, it's not because I'm deleting them. It's because you probably used Bitcoin or crypto or certain words that I have initially set to be flagged for review so that you guys don't get all of those crazy spam comments. Because the last thing I want is for anybody to get spammed uh, when they come here and check out one of my videos by somebody who doesn't have anything better to do with their life. All right, that being said, let's get right into the meat and potatoes of today's video. And this article actually came out on Monday from Tip Ranks and it said two top rated stocks that could be bargain buys in 2022. Now with the market constantly in flux, especially over the last couple of months, it's no surprise that the average person is looking for a stock that is well rated by professional analysts to add to their portfolio and hopefully to make a lot of money off of. And those top rated stocks are considered strong buys by the analysts. And the more analysts rate them strong buys, the more likely it is there's a consensus among the financial professionals that that stock is going to do well. And the two stocks we're talking about today have exactly that. A lot of financial professionals giving them a strong buy rating plus over 50% potential upside in the next 12 months, which basically covers all of 2022. So here's the first stock we are going to talk about today. And that's Caesars Entertainment, ticker symbol CZR. And they are a venerable name in the casino industry. The modern incarnation of the company was formed in 2020 from a merger by purchase when El Dorado Resorts bought Caesars and then took on the name. The current company boasts 53 casino, resort, and hotel properties, mostly in the US, but with one location each in Canada and Dubai. Nearly one third of Caesars properties, 16 total, are located in the state of Nevada. Taking a look at the tip ranks chart, CZR trading for 86.68 as of the time of this specific image. But look at this, 11 ratings, strong buy, 10 purchases, uh, 10 buys, I'm sorry, with just one hold. And this has a 61.17% upside for the next 12 months to an average analyst price target of 139.70. But check out the high on this one, guys. It could potentially go up to $191 according to one of these analysts. It's hard to find an industry that drips cash as copiously as casino gambling. And even during the pan panic year of 2020, Caesars managed to bring in $3.5 billion in top line revenue. This year with the economy mostly reopened and consumers both flush with cash and on the prowl for entertainment and leisure, Caesars has already seen a $6.8 billion in revenue. That's just for the first three quarters. The company has been working hard to turn around some of its earnings following a strategic plan to increase income. In one facet of this, Caesars in April of this year bought the sports betting company William Hill in a transaction valued at $3.7 billion. The acquisition was rebranded as Caesars Sportsbook, and Caesars recouped much of the purchase price when it sold the European side of the business for $3 billion to 888 Holdings. 
Now, in his review of this industry giant, five-star analyst David Bain writes, and I quote, We believe Caesar's iconic brand and loyalty synergies from its pure high room count scale and rewards membership are scarce attributes. Despite portfolio outperformance and advantages versus peers, our $143 per share land-based valuation utilizes target multiples in line with peers and historical averages, conservative actually in our view. He goes on to add that in regard to the company's outlook and expansion plans, we believe the CEO Tom Riggs' deal track record indicates there is more to come, potentially and ultimately unleashing a better digital valuation than peers with better than investor expected market share gains. In line with his outlook, he rates the CZR shares a buy and puts that $191 price target on uh, the CZR stock, which is a upside of 104%. So there's the background for that $191 high-end price target, which is literally doubling the target price from where we stand today. All right, so there's your first stock. Let's talk about the second stock we're looking at today, and that is Paragon 28. Paragon 28, ticker symbol FNA. Now this is the second stock we're looking at and it's about as different from Caesars as you can possibly get. Paragon 28 is a medical device company and they specialize in orthopedic foot and ankle treatments. The company's name even references the number of bones found in the foot. Paragon 28's product line includes a range of surgical aids and orthopedic prosthetics and implants, all aimed at improving patient outcomes and maintaining function in your feet. Looking at ticker symbol FNA on the tip rank site, they're trading at over $19 today, but they have four strong buy ratings. It's a unanimous decision for all analysts involved, and they have a 56.25% potential upside to a possible price target of $29.75 in the next 12 months. Again, that 2022 period, and the highest price target given out by any of the analysts, $31. Paragon 28 was founded in 2010 and nevertheless is fairly new to public markets. The company held its IPO in October of this year, with the FNA ticker making its Wall Street debut October 15th. The offering saw more than 7.8 million shares go up for sale with an IPO price of $16. Now overall, the company raised $125 million in gross proceeds from the sale. Now of interest to investors, Paragon 28 released its third quarter earnings report in November. The company showed $35.9 million in top line revenue, a really solid figure that represents a gain of 18% from last year's third quarter, and a gain of 45% from the pre-pandemic levels in their third quarters. So looking ahead to the fourth quarter, the company expects between 8 and 11% year over year growth, well ahead of analyst expectations of about 2%. Now, five-star analyst Kyle Rose is very bullish on this company. He writes, and I quote, Paragon 28 came in with a solid first print as a Republic company. Beating guidance and the street despite a difficult third quarter, backdrop given the continued strain of the different you know, virus going on, and procedure deferrals and staffing shortages. The company saw continued momentum within the business globally and despite a somewhat conservative guide for the fourth quarter with the virus lingering, we expect the groundwork for growth acceleration in 2022 and beyond has been put in place. Now, with a broad portfolio for solutions for foot and ankle disorders, a compelling pipeline of iterative new product launches, and a strong and expanding commercial team, we believe Paragon 28 is reaching its growth stride and positioned to take share in the fastest growing segment of the orthopedic market. His upbeat outlook leads him to put a buy rating on the stock, and his price target of $27 does imply an upside of 46%. All right, so there you have it, guys. Those are the two stocks that we're looking at that could be a very, very bargain price today, but have significant impact going into 2022 with that 50 to 61% potential upside even over that, if you really uh, look at some of those analyst price targets, right? The first stock there, Caesars, up to 100% um, potential upside if you believe the analysts. Now, I will say, I'm not telling you guys to buy or sell any stock. I'm presenting information to you guys for entertainment purposes. Always follow up on these stocks. Do your own due diligence. I'm showing you what the financial professionals, these analysts have to say about them, showcasing the tip ranks uh, data sets so that you can utilize it going forward with your own uh, due diligence in your own 
analysis as to whether or not these stocks fit your risk profile and your, your style of investing. As always, I really appreciate you guys checking out the video. If you haven't already, take two seconds, smash that like button for me, consider subscribing to the channel, and until next time, bottoms up.